I always wanted to be a physician since I was a very young uh, kid. Uh, that's what my mother tells me. I guess she said that my Santa Claus list always included a medical bag. So that seems to be that it was already determined, I guess. There's also many members of the family that have been physicians. So I guess I'm following that tradition. As an internist, you screen a lot. Whereas as a neurologist, you have the ability to sit down, to listen, to interact, to get a good history. And you can still examine and touch the patient and you can understand the problems. Then you can sit down and discuss your opinion and then come up with a plan. There is the intellectual aspect of the specialty that uh, is a very beautiful specialty. You really have to think through what you're trying to do, analyze the signals that the patient body is giving you and also what the patient is telling you and come up with a coherent hypothesis or a diagnosis and then come up with a coherent plan. Also allows you to do a lot of uh, investigation and research. You have to have this uh, connection with your patients and with the physicians who send your patients because you know the same way the, the, the patient will learn to trust you, your colleagues will begin to trust you too as well. So you want to develop a, 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 a network of physicians that you can help and provide hopefully what you think is, is a great service. You, you have to gain their trust as well. But at the end of the day, it's about the patient. At the end of the day, is what's best for the person. The person, the patient needs to know, and everybody around the person, the patient needs to know what is it that we're trying to accomplish. A network of physicians that you can help and provide, hopefully, what you think is is a great service. You, you have to gain their trust as well. But at the end of the day, it's about the patient. So nowadays, one of the beauties about what we do is that we have so many techniques, and we work so closely with our surgical colleagues that we can provide. On almost unlimited forms of therapy that can improve patients' quality of life. From the neuroimaging and MRIs to nuclear medicine that now becomes an integral part of what we do, to electrodiagnostic studies, what we call narconocturnal studies, EMGs, looking at the nerves and the muscles. Uh, uh, now we can assess the autonomic nervous system in a unique fashion. The field of neurology has expanded to the point that now you can have, most people can have a very decent quality of life and have uh, their, their lives pretty much not be shortchanged by, by any of these things. I love my family. I have um, five children, four girls and a boy, and then obviously, obviously my wife, and uh, they are pretty much everything to me. Um, so once I leave work, I just want to spend time with my family.